everyone and welcome back to another video of Genshin with Daka. Today we're going to be discussing the new weapon banner as well as Mihoyu's confirmation on character rarities. So let's get right into it but before we do I'd like to say that when we get to 50 subscribers I will be doing an account giveaway with a standard banner 5 star. Uh, just thought I'd let you know. So let's get into it. For the 5 star weapons on the weapon banner that will come with the Aika banner, we have obviously the Mid Splitter Reforged, which is Aika's special weapon, and we have the Skyward Spine, which is a really good polearm. For the 4 stars, we have the Stringless, which is a really good weapon, Favonius Sword, Favonius Lance, Favonius Codex, and Sacrificial Greatsword. Uh, I'm not too hyped about this because Favonius Sword, Lance, and Codex all suck. The, the Favonius weapons are just bad in general, and if you're going to be wishing on a weapon banner, you, you want to have some good 4 stars there. The Stringless is a good 4 star, but the Sacrificial Greatsword, the only character it would be that okay on is Chung Yoon. But the Stringless is probably the only good 4 star here, or the best 4 star here. And the Favonius weapons just don't shine that much. And Skyward Spine is good for any support polearm user, but there aren't that many polearm users in the game. But if you do get a Skyward Spine, it'll be great on a Zhang Ling. So not too bad. So overall, the 5 stars on this weapon banner look great, but the 4 stars, not except for the string list, they're not that good. Now, let's talk about confirmation of character rarity. So, I did not come up with this idea. Uh, Thunder Egg did, but I watched his video on it, and I was just thinking I'd let you guys know because that's how information gets passed along. And I do not take credit for this at all, so uh, everything is his idea. So, basically, when Patch 1.1 came out, on the Mihoyo Chinese Billy Billy website, they listed in Chinese um, characters. So they had Zhongli, they had Child, they had Jinyan, and they had Diona. And obviously, we know that Zhongli and Child are five stars, and that Diona and Jinyan are four stars. So it was pretty easy to tell that they're going to put the five stars first and then the four stars. And they did the same thing for patch 2.0. They listed, we have Aika, then they had uh, Ye Miko, Kokomi, Yomiya, Ball, then Sayu, um, Toma, Sara, and Goru. And as we know, we know that Ball and Yomiya and Kokomi and Yemiko and Aika, they're all five stars. And then we know that Sayu is a four star. So everything under Sayu also has to be a four star. And this way we know that <clears throat> Toma and Goru on Sara are going to be four stars. Because uh, there were a lot of speculations that Goru would be a five star and that Sara would be a four star. But apparently now we know some new stuff that Goro will be a 4-star as well. So it seems very exciting. And I just wanted to share this information with you. And one last little bit before I go. Um, in my Genshin anniversary video, What to Expect, I saw a comment where some where one person said that there's going to be... there. She heard a rumor or he heard a rumor that there's some sort of thing that will allow you to get a free 5 star and you can't choose which one but it is a free 5 star so i like to know if you guys heard this rumor or what you think about it because i want to know more about it so thank you for watching have a nice day and genshin with daka out